And to spell that again, that is O T S E G O. Please check them out because they so richly deserve it. Uh, guys, thank you again so much for coming on. Thank you. Thank you. Dude, you guys thank rocked you. it, man. Thank you, Brian, too. Hells to the yes. All right, Justin. Uh, are we out of time? What's our story, man? I can't that is we, about... We, our signal stayed up the entire time. It's barely holding on by a thread. It looks like total crap from where I'm sitting. But we have made it through this whole thing. Yes, absolutely. Uh, folks, if you have bared with this episode, I am so glad that we were able to at least deliver a kick-ass music group at the end of it. Uh, we, hold we on, know that hold this one... on. I think we learned some valuable truths, not only about ourselves, but about your fake <laughs> laughter and about the rockin' sequel to It's a Wonderful Life coming to theaters and eventually to Netflix and to streaming. It's I so think wonderful. this has been a very positive experience. Absolutely. Uh, but until next week, ladies and gentlemen... This is Justin Robert Young. Do you see your name? Oh, oh, hey, I'm Brian Brushwood. I'm sorry, I was confused. Dying of fire. This... Yeah, dude, see you next Tuesday. Can I read this story? Uh, yeah, well, actually, is, is that Seagull gone? Are they still there? Yeah, he's gone. Okay. I think they're still there. Um, well, listen. Uh, I'm almost positive they got a clean copy of that because it was rocking so hard. No? I can't, I can't hear you, buddy. Oh, check, check. One, two. Tony, Seven? cut this out. OMG Chad, cut the music. Yeah, the music's no. gone. Isn't the music Music's gone? gone. What? Are you there, Brian? Yeah, I was trying to shout over the music. I could only hear the music. There, okay. There hasn't been music for a little while. Our board does funny things. It's very possible oh, that Brian haunted? was still hearing the music. Oh, good <laughs> guy, because I'm wondering what's going on. I'm like, wow, you're just really letting half the song play. So <laughs> no, from no. your perspective, I'm just gone randomly insane. Yeah. And I'm like, stop, everyone stop. <laughs> yeah, we, we were feeding the uh, returns to Skype through auxiliary channel. So when I pot everything down to the recording and to the stream, you may still be hearing stuff. <laughs> okay, gotcha. Uh, sorry, what were you saying? Yeah, uh, everybody, a lot of people in the chat room, actually, Time Warner in the chat room wants to point out that you're completely ripped. <laughs> <laughs> I am very, uh, I've been working out. A lot of people, thank you for noticing. Um, so, uh, yeah, there we go, folks. Uh, I'll see if I can, I, I, I believe that they have, that they have a, uh, the live version that they played uh, for us, so we'll be able to get that up there for you guys, but please go, uh, Go support them, because they're really awesome, and I love that song, and uh, I love those guys. So make sure that you do right by them, and, and uh, follow them on Twitter if you dug the music, because I thought it was pretty awesome. And it's yes. Uts- yes, it definitely was. And you know what else is awesome? The story of the greatest fail ever. Do you want... I, I don't know. I'm a little bit nervous about how to read it. <clears throat> I'm still creating it live. Do you, do you want to read it, or should I? Uh, let's see, is this it? Yeah, the Google Doc. <laughs> the greatest fail ever. This is definitely something, but I'm not sure what. A cat crack special report. <laughs> In Berlin, free Germany during the Cold War. On the first day of school, or possibly a couple days after, while wearing a trench coat and carrying a bloody chainsaw, young Rustin Jobber Old, an obviously fictional character, but probably not, ran towards class. Rustin had been trying to learn fire eating for years now. He had studied everywhere but Cuba and certain provinces <laughs> in Indonesia. They're adding so many pictures I've got to jump off everything. See, yeah, we need to, we need to actually shut it down before we read it. it. Never mind. There's, there's no way. It's getting all crazy. Although there was some good stuff here. Um, Rustin had been trying to learn fighter eating for years. On the ra- way, he ran into Mindy, beautiful Mindy, perfect Mindy, lactose and hippie intolerant Mindy, the most populous girl in the class. I think they meant popular. 
Uh, since she was a nice young lass, she the quiet type, but with a complexion like the late OMG Chad's backside and a theme song to match, she was everything that old had ever dreamed of. <laughs> Don't look uncomfortable. <laughs> Mindy smiled and waved like an ambient walrus in her cute little Diamond Club shirt that she obviously got from the most trendy store on Bone Earth, P.D. Elahanty's. <laughs> Young old darted faster, smiling and accidentally sneezing out a little blood. Oh, I've been locked out of the document. Look at that. I just got <laughs> locked out of the document. Well, that's as much as I was able to read. Hope you guys enjoyed this story. Um, hey, can I just read a random, uh, a random two sentences? Sure. Oh, wait, hold on. You already got to that. Let me read a random two sentences then. Um... How about this? Here's the rap. What's up? I'm the Schwartz, and I'm here to say I got a show on Twit, but I ain't gonna stay. Because I got a big ninja son, and I whip it out just for fun. Test, test, test. Time more cable can suck that. What? They ain't worthy of a tummy stick. Bouncing up and down with a roundhouse kick. My heart is beating. Come on, lick, lick, lick. Lick in that dugout. No matter how nappy. Ninja John son. Slap me, pappy. Random, <laughs> random ass pappin. Can make me happy. But that's okay. You know we was nasty. Fun, 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 fun. 2 a.m., y'all, and I'm still here. Time on a cable provokes my fear. Still streaming on the web bird nets. What's the heck? The chat realm best yet. I'm on a cable, maybe scream and shout. Oh, F word. Hold on. I lost it. <laughs> I'm on a cable, maybe scream and shout. You can suck their thumb and moan and pout. Pubes over here, pubes over there. Rubbing on Bri's face and it's spicy and spiky F and air. <laughs> Splashing Popot on your face. LOL. What? Yeah, toast. I was a bigger fan of this. Uh, oh my god, <laughs> we we gotta stop this right now because now it's like I'm reading the story. There's Michael Rooker and how you were conceived. <laughs> uh, all right, what, what are we gonna call this one? <laughs> Don't listen. <laughs> <laughs> no way! Come on, man. Message from uh, time travel. Message from the past. <laughs> How much is It's a Wonderful Life too? <laughs> Dude, that's exactly what I was going to suggest. <laughs> it's a Wonderful Life too. <laughs> yeah. Uh, T-O-O? All right. No. Uh, no, 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 no. The number two. Like, super, Although maybe that is actually Roman funnier Roman. considering who else is has the Wonderful Life. <laughs> <laughs> um, but no, no. Let's just have the number two. So people... Okay. Get the, get the joke. All right, here we go. So this is uh, this is what? Look. This is episode eighty three, right? Here we go. Mm-hmm. This is NSFW episode eighty three for July fifth, twenty eleven. NS. I'm oh, sorry. Well, no, well go ahead. And do it. All right, here we go. This is NSFW episode 83 for July 5th, 2011. It's a Wonderful Life 2. That work? That works. That worked. Um, How bad was my internet the whole time? It actually did not get terrible. It was really rough because I was hearing everything in my ear. You're like a half second delayed on there. Um, then we did toward the end. Um, apparently the NSFW show Gmail account is temporarily unavailable. What do you mean? I don't know. You won't let me get into the documents. See documents. Um, are you logged in with that or what? I don't know what the hell's going on. Let me check out. All right, here we go. 
Uh, Jammer B, do you want the uh, billboards first or the uh, summary first? Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm, I'm marking the times for, for everything, so Tony will find All right. them. Here we go. Here's Netflix. Um, <clears throat> this episode of NSFW is brought to you by Netflix. Watch thousands of TV episodes and movies on your PC, Mac, iPad, iPhone, or TV instantly. All streamed directly to you, saving you time, money, and hassle. For your free 30-day trial, go to netflix.com slash twit. There we go. Oh, my God. What? I was unprepared for that. I had this thing <laughs> in my ear, and all of a sudden, everything exploded with pain. Can, can we dial back the uh, the squeal just a little bit on this one? Sure. <laughs> and by Squarespace, the fast and easy way to create a high-quality website or blog. For a free trial and 10% off your new account for six months, Go to squarespace.com and use the offer code NSFW7. Hey. <laughs> stop, 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 stop. Uh, somebody just put a Mac Rumors article saying Netflix resolves Apple TV streaming issues. Mac Rumors? That's kind of awesome. That was there, was was there issues? Some users experienced errors when connecting to Netflix over the holiday weekend. Netflix claims the issues have now been fixed, blah, 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 blah. <coughs> That's not really as big a deal as I thought it was going to be. I was able to watch stuff over the weekend. Yeah. Then I watched Jan Silent Bob Strike Back and Austin Powers 3. I don't know. Whoa. That's the heavy from uh, Street Fire or from Team Fortress Two. Wow, that's awesome! <laughs> I can't turn it up without hearing it, and then you catch it on the other on the other thing. That's awesome. <laughs> They're saying it sounds like me, which it's, you know what? I'll own that. Yeah. So what else we got? <coughs> uh, tease. Tease. Oh, yeah. All right. In this, easily the most harrowing episode in NSFW show history, Brian is under siege. War has come to this podcast. Will we survive? Will we muse about the fate of Hitler should he be in a sequel of It's a Wonderful Life? Will the band Otsego play with such wicked force that your face will melt off into a puddle that your dog will lick up? Yes. It's all happening on this edition of NSFW Show. Starting now. <laughs> One take gerbs. That's what they call you back <coughs> in the day. Yes. Hey, you know what's awesome? Blowing out your voice, fake laughing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> <laughs> Justin, Justin. Yeah. Airline peanuts. <laughs> what happened?
People are telling me to reread the story, but I think I'm locked out of the dock. Also, I think I have to be up in four hours to go to the airport. Four and a half hours. Where are you going? Where are you going? What's that? Where are you going? Where are you going? Uh, I have a show in Massachusetts, unfortunately. Springfield, Massachusetts. I fly into uh, Rhode Island, Providence, Rhode Island. Go in and then go back. And then... um, and, uh, and then I come back home, and then I'm on vacation for an entire week, which is an awesome place to be. It has been an insane two weeks. Not only, like, I mean, my brain thought it was weird. Week number one was two college shows, an anime convention, uh, a, uh, a, a skeptic convention, uh, a presentation for the Department of Justice. Then I come home for one night, and then the next week was... 17 podcasts in one week. Wow. Oh, yeah, because you oh, shot yeah, all the, uh, the uh, scam schools. 12 episodes of scam school, did the PC Gamer <laughs> podcast, did Frame Rate, NSFW, I did um, uh, This Week in Tech, and uh, At the Controls. It was insane. It was, it was crazy. It was a crazy week, and I'm home for today was my one day. I'm home at this one day, and then I'm out again. So there's that. Um, um, that's pretty epic, man, and I'm I'm glad that you're coming to the end of it. Uh, I do want to uh, let me plug this real quick. So yeah, um, please, I'm going out to Las Vegas tomorrow, and I'm going out there because uh, Bicycle Playing Cards is paying me to interview poker people during the World Series of Poker. So do yourselves a favor and subscribe to the uh, Bicycle Playing Card YouTube channel. I will uh, send you guys out a link for uh, the exact account when I know it, but I believe it's just going to be the official one. Um, and uh, that that the people who hired the people who are hiring Justin are definitely going to look at the comments on these interviews. So do us a favor and uh, let people know what you liked about them. Uh, yes. So watch them and like them. They're going to be fun. I don't know if they're going to be like NSFW. I'm like, I'm not going to lie to you and say that I have complete creative control on this because I don't. So it could just be me going, hey, so what's the deal with poker? <laughs> How do you know when somebody's lying? Yeah. Huh? So do you, do you look for an, see now, now if it was an NSFW interview, it would look the same, but it'd be like, how do you know if somebody's lying? Huh? Do you look for like an eye twitch? Maybe like the eyes blinking in Morse code, and it says, BT Dubs, I am a liar. And then all of a sudden, she pulls off her mask, and she's a space alien, but like a hot space alien. And so you go up, and you start caressing her on the face, and then you get like halfway through putting your moves on, and then you remember it's your turn, and you've got you've to uh, put more money in the pot. And then you're like, ah, oh, I forgot that poker even existed. But then all of a sudden, you go all hippied out, and you're like, what is money to us? Boy, money is keeping me in <laughs> bad place i should relax and understand that we're all one and the globe is connected and that we're all one with the universe after all string theory suggests that all of we see is all part of nothing but vibrating energy that i am energy and you are energy and you and i are together and we feel each other and in this moment nothing exists but you and me and then he leans in for a kiss that's an nsfw interview tony make sure that goes into the show like, in the middle of whatever we were doing in the middle of the show. Just throw that in, because that's way better than what we did. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> no, that's pretty amazing. Uh, I, that would be what would happen. Here, uh, let me test out this question for you, Brian. So, uh, let's say I'm, you're a fire poker player. I'm a poker pro. Oh, I go, hi. This is Justin Young for um, whatever this thing I'm doing. Uh I got a poker question for you, sir. Um, All right. Let's say on, I'm, I'm I'm playing poker everywhere I go, son. <laughs> let's say um, you uh, you got two two eights, a pair of eights wired. Okay, you got one Is it jack. Is that a thing? Yeah. And then you have Are a you jack, know? and then you have uh, you see coming down the river uh, a another another eight. Okay, but you think that the person across from you has uh, three queens, and then your son texts you and uh, tells you that he just made out with his same-sex best friend. 
What's your play? Mm. Stand pat. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> and then a card drops. And he looks for the card that just dropped. This is, a, this is a better show when I have bandwidth. Oh, yes. Oh, I agree. <laughs> I don't think you'll find much objection there. Uh, is that a real question, by the way? No. It's one I just made up for laughs. How did that work out for you? No, that I've done the, I'm sorry, do it again, do it again. No, I'm That's not. I'm not okay, going to do it again so you can fake laugh. <laughs> what are you talking about? Who said I was going to fake laugh? I, I, uh, what are you talking about? Um, you, you're going to just laugh at me. But for not for fun, for, for evil. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, Brian, your laughs sometimes, you can do hurtful laughs. Please don't do the hurtful laughs. <laughs> why? Why yeah. must you hurt me so? Why must you hurtful laugh? <laughs> All of a sudden, Clarence comes flapping down. You're like, Justin. And you're like, oh, crap. <laughs> you're like, I got something to show you. <laughs> um, I can't believe I've never told the, the that dude is ripped story before on an SFW. Some people knew that in the chat room. So I think you told it before. I think it was like on BB Live Show or something. Epic fail for the... Like, it's my one story that when people ask for an embarrassing story, that's what you go. Rabbit Badger corrects me and points out it's his heroin black wings. Yes. It is his black tar heroin. black tar heroin wings. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you and I went to the exact same place. We did. Uh, <clears throat> So Put your feet uh, off the table, Johnson. God, I'm Johnson, so glad he you know died. What? Treat that, that place like a dorm room to... that you know is getting demolished. What do you care, man? Rub your feet on that table? Rub your backside <laughs> on that table? You're out of there. What's it matter? You're like, oh, what? History and broadcasting was made I... right here? But guess whose butt is on it? Yeah, exactly. How about a history just made by my butt smells? <laughs> Do you think anyone's watching? Do you think anyone's ever <laughs> you tried think to... anybody would try to survive that train wreck of a show <laughs> and are still watching right now? No. Uh, first I of all, it was so. not the train wreck of the show. And I'll not have you call it that. With, because, you know what? It, it, it was a different show and it was <laughs> awesome. Part of a storm in that room. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you guys tell me. Was that a train wreck or awesome? Write one word. Train wreck or awesome. Only one. Don't write both. Because you know what? I know you guys turn in. Looks for like we train. have one vote for penis. Hey, should we, get, uh, should we get the Kyle Gass Project on? No. I will not have them on anymore. They've had enough <laughs> attention. <laughs> what the hell? Really? <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> I like uh, I like one of his like oh wait was penis an option because I vote for penis. <laughs> uh, yes, okay, it was awesome. People loved it, and we love you, and we think you're delightful. Uh, Chad, where are you at on rubbing your butt on everything? People are really into this. It's uh, become a natural, uh, a cultural uh, obsession. Casey Anthony's over now. They've moved on to Chad rubbing his butt on the twin furniture. Well, where are you at on that? butt on everything is that what you said yeah apparently there's a rumor going around we're on to you that your your master plan is to rub your butt on everything before the the cottage uh is is moved over i don't understand what you're talking about that's really weird you, we're saying <laughs> <laughs> come on chad that's where my butt was you're not gonna rub your butt on where my butt was come on i don't that's that's is, that the big, is that the big game? Say. It's like on our way out of the cottage, we rub our butt on as many twit objects as we're able to. Maybe. These are two tweets, a random sampling of the last two tweets I got. Both of them, positive. One of them clearly has a picture of you with her. Yes. I mean, that's when I paid her to say nice things about the show. 
<laughs> you're like, listen, first of all, take this picture doing the Diamond Club symbol. Now. That didn't work out as well as I had hoped. Wait, what did I do? Something just awesome just happened. No, I, I, I was trying to get m- multiple chairs near me so it would look as if, like, I was moving from chair to chair. But when I moved this chair, I, like, unplugged three things by accident because <laughs> there's so many cables on the ground. So I'll tell you what, man. Before you know it, they'll be playing the hit song, But, But. Oh, and you what? <laughs> but, But. Oh, and- <laughs> Well, congratulations, Chad. Chris Ronan says that you ruined the show. I'm sorry. I don't even know what 15 that. minutes after it was done, you reached <laughs> back in time, and you ruined the show. I'm sorry. It was my butt's fault. I'm going to blame the butt. What, what? What, 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 blame what? The butt. what, what? Blame the butt? What, what? what? OMG butt. <laughs> Had to move the digital mixer. What, what? Blame the butt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is that yeah, what we, everyone's saying? Oh my. That that my butt ruined our quality. Is that what they're saying? Sure. Oh, they'd be right. Damn. Yes. Um. Look, man. If it were up to me, I would live here 24 hours a day at all times with you guys. But instead, I unfortunately have to go to sleep sometime in the next hour. So I'm gonna bid you a fond adieu, uh, but remind you that. I'm going to be on vacation for five days. So during that time, I you. hope for you to send me postcards. Since I know that's impractical, <laughs> why, don't you, why don't you send me tweets instead? You can, and I'm sorry this is so subtle here, you can tweet me at Schwood, right? Or you can Google Plus me at what? G plus dot two slash Schwood. Mainly do the Atchwood thing. There you go. And with that... <laughs> oh, I thought you were all like, Hey, look at me. I'm, I'm all Google+. Plus. I am I'm all Google+. Plus. Plus. Well, I'm Mr. Google+. Plus Plus. You are. I'm perfectly I love Google+. Google Plus. I, I hang out with people all the time. Man, you better check me out on Google+. Plus. You might be able to hang out with me and look at my face on the screen. Like, that's a real shocker. Hey, that'd be amazing. Uh... Hey, but yeah, follow me, Justin R. Young. If anybody's not following me, follow me, Justin R. Young. But really, um, do two things that aren't me related at all. Number one, buy Andrew Maine's books. And it's more specifically, I mean, anybody who's read Andrew Maine's books, uh, either Public Enemy, Grendel's uh, Shadow, or, or Chronological Man, uh, do us a favor and review it if you can uh, on Amazon or. Uh, Brendel, on. The Chronological Public Enemy, Volume 3, The Beginning. Yeah. The Beginning. So, beginning. Or, on, or on iBooks, if you can. They, you know, just uh, just do us a favor. Oh, if you like it. you know, If, if you thought if you, it sucked, then keep your crap uh, to yourself. Justin, how do you respond to criticisms, for example, the dude who complains that Andrew's books are just too expensive? Um, well, I think he's putting himself square in line for It's a Wonderful Life 3. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, man, a whole series of movies where Clarence just convinces people they need to kill themselves would be an awesome sequel. This is where it needs to go. <laughs> it's a wonderful life, too. Fixing uh, errors. Fixing errors. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's all I got. That's amazing. All right. Uh, so there we go, folks. Uh, check it out. Uh, and then also, uh, do me a favor. <laughs> buy a brick. I really... Sorry. I buy a brick. Are they still selling bricks? Yeah. How many more bricks do we got to sell? How many bricks do we I, I think three, four oh, billion. Three dozen. dozen. Three dozen. I don't know. Here's the deal, folks. You can buy all of them right now for $5. Go to bricks.twit.tv and then subject prices are subject to change. <laughs> <laughs> um, but actually, you know, here's the deal. Listen, you can buy it. This is absolutely true because Brian told me. He said, Justin, make sure you say this at the end of the show because I'm not going to say it. I'm just going to sit there and look confused. Uh, tell all of Chat Realm that they can go to uh, bricks.twit.tv and use the, uh, the coupon code Brian Brushwood told me to do this. But you just you enter it in for the full amount, put your credit card information in, and then just yell at your computer. 
Brian Brushwood told me to do this. And then as you hit submit, the computer will hear you and take off and at all but five dollars. <laughs> Yes, that um, is true. So, yeah, so you, do that. Bricks.twit.tv. No, seriously, everybody. Uh, I know. How many bricks did we end up buying uh, in, our, um, in our big drive? We, we, well, we got the one, the one eight by eight of uh, the, and I was trying to find that logo here just recently. They'll post it in the chat room, the winning logo. But we also have a top seven sayings as well. Man, we got a crap ton of bricks. Plus, the Diamond Club that by himself, Jammer B, made happen with the boo boo. What? What? That's history, man. Plus, uh, uh, we can confirm that some <clears throat> of the... We had a vote. Some of the winning ones were, first of all, number one was Tony edit this brick out. Uh, number two <laughs> was where the white brick's at. Uh, <laughs> my favorite. <laughs> that is my favorite. And, um, Tell me there's a uh, double complete rainbow brick. I don't know. Double. Com- I don't know. Double complete rainbow brick. Because then uh, anyone s- could get that. It doesn't you know, need to just be us. There we go. This is our image right there. Boom, boom. Wow. That's on a... Right? Awesome. Wow. It's double complete brick. And it is a double complete brick because it will <laughs> appear to be two bricks side by side. Uh, dude, it's going to be amazing. I love everybody. So do me a favor. Uh, and Brian, you were just there... Last weekend, uh, you know, I was there. Uh, I got back from there last weekend. I think you can say without hesitation that uh, it is an amazing achievement what is going on in that studio, right? Oh, dude, it, it is unreal. It is unreal by all definitions. And, in fact, I'm actually I'm getting distracted because I just got a tweet that um, Veronica Belmont is hanging out. And... Uh, in fact, of all people, um, there we go. This is this was just sent out by uh, Gary Witta, and I'm trying to figure out who else was in the hangout with her. Oh, get rid of this crap. Uh, yeah, there's Gary Witta and Dan Stapleton, and I can't see who else. But uh, all of a sudden, I'm betting we missed it. That yeah, had to go super fast, dude. How is she awesomely lit in a hangout? She is just never not awesomely lit. She would not have bandwidth problems like this. And if she did, <laughs> she would call on a phone and she would sound awesome. And you know what? Yeah. I bet Clarence never, ever bothers her for anything, ever. No. Clarence shows up accidentally sometimes and he's like, oh, never mind. Sorry. Oh, I gotta sorry. Go try to get Tito Chavez confused. to kill himself. Awkward. <laughs> and he asks for advice on the way out. Uh, oh, yeah. All right. Hold on. Let me say one thing and then we'll leave. Uh, but I just have one more. I have one political statement to make. Um, number one, yes, when, this. when Leo Laporte, what? When Leo Laporte oh, sorry, does what? the first ever, um, the first ever broadcast from the Twit Studios, the New Brick uh, Studios, I don't think I just jive that a horse's ass with a MacBook was in any way any kind of legitimate broadcast from that. Yeah, I'm surprised. Not one word. Not right. one word because it's bogus and it's crap. And if you're gonna if you're gonna run that, then it's like you got to figure out the first time for the drop cam or whatever. But that it, it, no, yeah, I mean, like, listen, it, it was it was a joke. It was a joke on TNT, and and I, it really if if in, in any way there's anybody either at the cottage or who listens to this show that thinks that me doing pulling a stupid uh, a little you know, not sassy even pants. close, Justin. As it soon was as I hooked even... up the 35 megabit sonic symmetrical Ethernet to the first mile, it was during a This Week in Science after show. I Skyped into Alex. He put me on the air, and I rode the uh, conveyor belt. That was back in February. Absolutely. So that is Absolutely. That is officially so, the first broadcast was Jammer B. No, that's not. No, the first broadcast <laughs> will be Leo Laporte, as it was, is, and should be. And uh, we will all watch it, and we will all look uh, with, with tears in our eyes at a great man who has achieved something truly magnificent. Uh, Jammer B riding a uh, conveyor belt like a can of ham, and 
me jiggling in Tomas Marut's uh, standby stool uh, while I do a, a jig in front of the drop cam is not that, okay? And so I don't want to hear any of this, oh, it's like a, I'll be a, a, a Wikipedia thing. No, it was not in any way a, a broadcast from that from that studio. So I don't hear any of that. There we go. <laughs> So it is spoken, so it shall be. Twitter.com slash Otsego Music. Boom. I love you kids. Dying of fire. Uh, by the way, Free Lunch says nice reverse psychology, Jerry. You understand. There's no reverse psychology. This is... this is. If I've ever been serious about anything on the show, I'm serious about this. I don't... Yes. Like, I know... Chow Realm hangs out in the Twitch chats a lot. Okay. I know that you guys, and I, this, is, this is not a fun bit thing. This is me pleading with you that if you see somebody say, oh, what an asshole Justin was for streaming from the studio, then you please inform them that that is not true. I'm asking you to set the record straight. Right. Specifically, Jammer B was first. Jammer no, B. Do not blame it on Jammer B either. <laughs> but if you're going to pick between the two of us. OMG <laughs> Chad released YouTube videos of him playing with the jib. It was definitely no, OMG that. Chad. Ivan, Ivan was on the drop cam a few times having the OMG Chad show. Did you really? Yeah, but it was like only 20 seconds. It wasn't like a whole TNT show or anything. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let's make it clear. I will crack your fragile little neck. <laughs> um... Yes. All right. Love you guys a million times over. And with that, I say... Problem solved. Peace out, suckers. Come on, Chad. You can get it right. <laughs> get it right. right. Come on. You can get it right. a microphone in my way. Yeah, bitches. Uh, all right, guys. I love you all. Peace out. you love from people you trust this is twit, twit.